Hey there, it's Charlene, and welcome to Ask the HR Girl, where once a week we demystify your HR challenges. And this week's question, causing trouble on the way out the door. Okay, let's check it out. Dear HR Girl, I own a small nonprofit, and recently one of my senior directors was accused of wrongdoing by another employee when they turned in their letter of resignation. I'm inclined to chalk it up chalk it up to the employee making accusations <clears throat> because they are leaving. However, it could be a real problem if this alleged wrongdoing turns out to be true. Any advice? Well, depending upon how the employee views their experience with working at your nonprofit, it may or may not be uncommon for them to mention things that could be true or not true on their way out the door. You know the employee's usual behavior, so be aware of the intention behind what they are sharing. Now, even though they are leaving, I would still strongly encourage treating the situation seriously by following whatever your process is for handling these types of things if the employee wasn't leaving and was going to be continuing their employment. Now, hopefully this process includes conducting a full inquiry into the alleged wrongdoing, beginning with a series of questions for the employee that is leaving to gather as many facts by asking the who, what, when, where, and how about the wrongdoing prior to their departure. And depending on what the alleged problem is, you still have an obligation to look into the matter, even if the employee leaves your organization. Now, if this concern is a potential liability exposure risk, seek counsel and have an expert conduct the inquiry. Sound employee relations is important in all phases of the employment cycle, including exits. And remember, former employees can be your greatest asset or a bit of a nightmare, depending upon their experience working at your organization. Thank you so much for your question, and I hope that that helps. And thanks everybody for tuning in and sharing a little bit of your time with me. I know how precious it is. And if you have an HR-related challenge, go to thehrgirl.com Click on Ask the HR Girl and submit your question. It might be our next video. Make it a different day and we'll see you the next time. Bye.